All right, now I'm going to show you how to assemble one of the other assemblies called that we call the uh, XYZ corner. This is an XYZ corner. Pretty heavy part. Pretty hardcore. But what this piece actually does is it terminates one end of one one end of one side of an X, a Y, and a Z axis. Makes sense. And what it also does is it holds bearings to guide the belts, and that's what goes here. These posts are for belts. So the way this works is pretty simple. You have two of these in a kit. One kit, one side gets built with two bearings. The other side gets built with one bearing. We're going to build them with one bearing. So you take your bearing cover. Very simple, just a little piece of plastic. And you pre-thread your M3s. These to build one of these, you'll need either two or four 608 bearings and four M3 by 10 millimeter screws. And you just pre-thread them a little bit, get them started, pop it on, and they, these holes will fit right into the holes in the middle of the posts. You can hand tighten a little bit to get them started. And I'll do the same thing on the other side. Oh, missed the hole. No comments from the peanut gallery. And again, when you when you build these with the single bearing, the bearings go on the inside towards the corner. <laughs> And when you finger when you start finger threading these, uh, make sure you're putting the right side in because these will only fit one way on each side. Even though it's technically only one part, it can be screwed in one of two ways. So now that we have that, those fingers started through the bearing cover, we'll start pushing them in. Do a little bit of hand tightening. And then we'll switch over to the screwdriver. And for so a lot of this construction, there's a lot of screws. I mean, for example, you're going to get 74 K screws. You won't need all of them. They are quarter 20 screws. They are big, burly screws. You can probably get away with two per side per corner. But we'll give you 74. That's a, 74 will be enough. Should be enough for one butt, nut, and bolt for every hole. But chances are you will never need them. Some of the nuts are really difficult to get to, but all the holes will be drilled. All the nuts, screws and nuts will be available for you, but you'll probably get away with two or three per side per corner. What I mean to say by that, it's like two or three here and two or three here. Here, I would do two, two, or one, two, three, four. And here I do one, two, or like one, two, three, something along those lines. You just need to get them firmly attached. But... This is an XYZ assembly, ready to go.